name is Jacob Rebell. I'm a staff engineer here at Keysight Technologies at our Novi Automotive Customer Center. Today we will be looking at generating automotive crank waveforms using two different softwares on our laptop. We will be generating it using our N6705C DC power analyzer. It is a modular power analyzer that uses the same modules as you will find in any of our low profile units. Uh, but it has a high enough switching speed to be able to actually get the detail we need for the crank waveforms. We will be using our 4000 series InfiniVision scope as a kind of makeshift dot to kind of show what's happening and what's coming out of our DC power analyzer. Let's take a uh, closer look at the software. So for our first software, we're going to look at our 14585 software. This software is connecting to a lot of our power analyzers. But the good thing about this software is it's super simple, super easy to use. From the software, you can control the front panel. Right from the software, if you so choose, you can turn on the second output, the third output, pretty much anything from that front panel. But what we're really using it for today is actually generating the arbitrary waveform generators. As I said before, the N6705C has a wider range of arbitrary waveform generation than some of our low profile units allowing us to create waveforms. The waveform we created here today is actually from one of the Ford compliance specs and it's I believe the cold cranking waveform but we've built it out before but as I said it's super easy to use if you want to add and modify anything you just pick what kind of waveform you want put in your numbers and it creates it right on the top of the screen. For a second software, we're going to be using our test automation on Pathwave. So this is kind of a scalable, uh, modular test executive software. So it's not specifically meant for, for instance, a power analyzer such as the 14585. It's a little bit more complex to use, but it has a lot more ability to it. So we can do the same thing as we kind of did earlier, which is create a waveform and send it through the power analyzer. But from here, you can code in and make, you know, many different options, including time delays, uh, set the channels, overcurrent protection, over voltage protection. You know, the, the options are limitless with this software. So, and the other thing is, is it's not, as I said, exactly tied to it. So if we wanted, we could even continue on and, you know, build out a module to control the scope that we're using as well, or anything else in your test setup that you would want. But as I said, as we're using it here today, we built out a similar waveform. I took out the repeating sine wave on it, but we can do a very similar thing. All right, so there you have it. There's two options that we've shown to create automotive crank waveforms using our software and some of our equipment. To contact Keysight about any product, to selection assistance, education, or training, call 1-800-829-4444 or visit us at keysight.com or as of course, you can contact any of your local Keysight contacts as well. Thank you for your time.